welterweight division is scheduled. Three rounds of five minutes. Referee is Mr. Daniel Sharifi. This one is not about those numbers. Not at all. You know what I mean? Please. This is not about those numbers. We mentioned Kepa is the guy you call to go into the collapse mine and save a guy, right? Uh, that means he's not afraid here. Like, this is not no. danger to him. This not is a man whose career is life and death. Yes, exactly. So this is not danger to him, which is why he can confidently and comfortably try to compete with a guy this skilled. Okay, ready? If you're fighting Fight. Chris Fishgold and you're smiling five seconds before... Yeah. Yeah, you're a lunatic. You're either, yep. Yeah, precisely. You're either incredibly brave or you've got a screw yeah. loose. Or both. Yeah. Oh. And goal is go. coming forward aggressively. Yep. Fishgold nice seeing jab. everything. Very, very fluent. I like the way he moves. Yeah. Little test there from Fishgold. Little pump. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's, he's committing. Caper, Caper felt that as well, the way he backed off. He's committing to his punches tonight. Just waiting for one to connect. This keeps on going like this. Yeah. Yeah. Capa's trying to move side laterally and, you know, change the the cadence of this one, but he's going to get fired on again any second. If he keeps on having Fish Gold miss like this, though, it's going to yeah. take a lot of energy from Fish Gold. Yeah, true. And then he can take over. Yep. Ooh. The knee on the break. Good job ducking under the punches so far from Kepa. Yeah, watch for uppercuts from uh, Fishgold too. <laughs> He's putting yeah. some sting behind those yeah. shots. And he answers with some sting of his own. This, this sort of arrhythmic bounce is actually a little tough to track. Like you see, oof. Oh, he's some stuck big against shots the fans there. He's got to be careful doing that. Connected with a couple good shots there. Fish called. Uh, Callum, you just mentioned like you can fatigue here. And he is committed so heavily to these punches. I saw a deep breath or two out of Fish called. Up until that one moment, Kepa was doing a great job moving away. Yes, yeah, when he got stuck up against the cage, that then Fishgold really Ooh. landed one or two big shots. So he's got an awkward way of moving out of yes. the way, but it's working so far. That's a good nice choice. Kick, yeah. yeah, good choice, but as you said, by Fishgold. Yeah, good choice at a good time. It's the when and the why that's as important as the what. If he keeps on moving like that, the way to take out the movement out of him is to calf kick him. Mm -hmm. Simple as that. Yep. Kepa is, is fully committed and fully in belief that he can knock out Fishgold, too. Oh, yeah, he can. Yep. He for sure can. He needs to commit, though. Yeah. He doesn't really believe in it so far. Yeah. And this man is committed. <laughs> Fishgold is committed. He tucks one down to the belly. And he comes so, forward, it's like a freight engine. Yeah, Fishgold's saying, yes, come forward some more, because that actually will play into his hands. He'll slip one and try to take these super, super heavy hooks and straight punches and just run them on one. Three minutes has gone by so far. Fun Kay. fight to watch. Yeah, a, a lot more tactical than I, uh, the ball yeah. we were maybe expecting. A lot of fainting back and forth and just trying to measure each other out. Another s smart approach by Kepa mm -hmm. instead of just turning it yeah. into an all-out war. Yeah, Fishcott has, you know, thrown more thrown a lot more punches than he has landed, and that's because Kepa's, you know, just got a kind of a, a weird time signature to the way he moves, so. So Fishgold Looks goes, like he's, yeah, he's maybe. He's got a front head look. Yeah. He's taking it back. Yeah. Smart okay, choice by Fishgold. Yeah. In, two, he's got the back. Two yeah. hooks in. See what he can do here. Yeah, he uh, he was having a hard time connecting with big punches, so I thought, okay, let's test you out here. It just slides to the okay. mount. Full cool mount. Yeah. Slides to the mount. He'll Some elbow. Elbow. Nice, oh, job. nice job. Very Kepa. nice job. But Get he him. stays with it. Get his hips right back into it. He's got a ten finger connection here. Probably holding the chin as well to control him. Chin and sternum on back, trying to go around that right arm. He's got to beat, and he does. Good oh. job by Kepler. Oh, yeah, oh, beautiful right. work. Yeah, lovely. Got a hold of the leg, and now he's on top. Yeah, did, good did, for him. Didn't let Fish go yeah. repeat that same sequence yeah. again. He saw and what he's happened. on the back. He's got the back. Oh, beautiful Kepa. work. Kepa came to fight. Very surprising. And See, these aren't small shots no, landing on Fishgold no. here. 
Going under the armpit and to the side. 25 seconds, a long time to absorb shots from, you know, the low back. Oh, knee to the body is a good choice, too. He's, over, a, he's, he's putting coming some heat on big knows. shots. I don't like that fish goal to staying on his knees here that long. He needs to get up. He needs yeah. to push his butt up. Yeah. That's it, 10 seconds. Big shots. The paper is unloading. Wow. I Very think surprising. Fish gold is surprised, too. He's trying to go uh, to the mountain. Beautiful work there. Yeah, oh, really nice. Magnificent yeah. reversal there. But Caper seemed to really grow into that second yeah. half of that round. If Fishgold came here thinking this was low level and what and all He's that was gonna do is gonna throw ten or fifteen big punches in the first two minutes and the fight would be over, he's wrong. He's breathing very heavy. Yeah. Yeah. Sitting down. Yep. Kepa is looking good. Kepa's looking real good. And you, you got to wonder, did he come here in full shape when you've been fighting the Kelvin Catters of the world? You're like, well, actually, I, I oh, me. So, holding his rib. So Fishgold is holding his rib and looking deeply uh, uncomfortable. Some of those yeah. shots. The knees, the knees. Yeah, from, yeah. from the turtle position. Yeah. I don't know if Caper has noticed that at all because I assume Fishgold will continue. That is a big weakness. So no. those deep, uh, no, he, no, I don't think no. he can go. Yeah, I don't I think, think he can go. I think yeah. this fight's done. No, I think this fight is over. Yeah, the referee yeah. has called it off. Yeah. Caper has won the main event wow. of LFL8. Yes. What so a surprise. Stefan, remember oh when you, wow. when he was punching him and then kneeing him, yeah. and we said, we don't like him still, uh, still uh, sitting there. there. It was because he couldn't breathe because yeah. his rib is broken. He was trying to yeah. def defend and protect his rib. Yeah, yeah. And he can't go. And Fishgold is in. Agony yeah, here. you can see by the way he's moving when Caper touched him. He just curled up yeah. into a ball like Yeah, he will be spending the night in a Dutch hospital tonight. Almost uh, definitely. How do you spell rematch? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I definitely would like to see it again, for sure. But remember Head as well, this is a welterweight bout, and we've had some fantastic welterweights come through again. That's true. But fish gold's fought fish gold, better with, weight. Yeah, it, yeah, true. But fish gold's you know, a body of work gives him the right to try to get a rematch if that's what he wants. Uh-huh. But, uh, I wow. want to see that lower, though. I want to see that lightweight or featherweight. Yes. Yeah. Well, Poland tonight. Kepa wins the main event. Piotr Kalinick beats Nils van Nord. Uh, Poland having a good night here tonight. So, and here guys we go. Yeah. From Poland. These are some of, these are some of the highlights. So, so this is when Fish Gold Yeah, the right top. arm blocked him. The right arm blocked him. And then, and he was tired. You can see. He was looking at his corner already over there. One of those knees probably broke the ribs. Yes, what I, yeah. what yes, I think. Yes, I think so. And you. So we can see here, this is the work that Caper was putting on, high intensity, laying down the shots. And Caper soon is you'll doing a crazy dance in the cage right now too, by the way. And soon you'll see some of these big knees coming in that we believe must have been one. Here we yeah. go, there's one. It was the but other side, the, though. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I believe it was the other side. Oh, look, here it is. <laughs> this was happening while we had the replays. And fortunately, we got a great team that gave us a replay of this, too. That's a man enjoying the moment, and he earned it. Yeah. Huge no, surprise, though. If we, obviously, we don't do betting odds here, but if we had some, you would have put Fish Gold as a clear, clear favorite here. Huge doc just won this fight. Incredible work by Caper, though. Just showing that anything can happen in MMA, especially if you've got that dog in you. But it looks like Fish Gold needs to go, so we'll just hand over to the announcer now. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this fight is the man in the blue corner, Adrian Caper! Adrian, Adrian Kepa. Yeah, we'd all like to see that rematch for sure, but I believe you, 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 I believe you broke his ribs tonight. I don't know. I think so. Knees to the body, I think broke his rib. Myślę, że już widziałem, że jest zmęczony i te kolana trenujemy codziennie w parterze. Trener mi gadał kolana, kolana, słyszałem i uderzyłem. It was the plan. Uh, he knew uh, his opponent is very tired uh, in the uh, last round, and he will uh, smash him this knee because this was game plan. He trained this uh, many times in the training, and uh, it was good. 
Well, congratulations for a big night for Poland here tonight. Yes. Uh, he would like a rematch. Would, would you fight him again? Jeśli się wszystko będzie zgadzać, czas, pieniądze, dlaczego nie? If everything will be, will be okay with his opponent, with time, with money, uh, there is no problem. It will be a pleasure. It's been a wonderful night and a great night for Poland. Congratulations, your winner in the main event, Adrian Kepa.